All right, uh, first we have wide receiver KD Nixon and running back Trayvon McMillan, and we will open it up to questions. Trayvon, obviously you guys had a huge lead in this game. Did you sense any complacency on the sideline? What, what do you think happened in this football game? I didn't sense any complacency, to be honest with you, but um, we just we just continued to – we didn't execute um, that second half the way that we were supposed to. They started to come back, and we just kind of – we just kind of – just cut it off a little bit. I, I don't think we, um, yeah, I think Oregon State just, you know, they had more energy than us out there. And I mean, they just brought their best game today. Katie, uh, the overtime, uh, that pass, you, it looks like you had it. Um, what happened at that, at that pass at the end? No, I dropped it. Uh, I let down the team, lost the game because of me, so. I live with it and make up for it. Sorry, I just walked in. I don't know if this was asked or not, but uh, can you guys talk about? It seemed like from the start there wasn't a whole lot of energy on this team. You had a nice little run there in the beginning, but or in the, in the middle. But can you talk about the energy coming out from the start of this game? Yeah, um, like I said, we didn't. We came out flat that second half and. Um, I just didn't think we executed um, all around the board. And um, I think we just have a lot to improve on. And um, we got to just get our minds right for Arizona now and, you know, just keep moving forward. Yeah, just how about from the start of the game? I mean, uh, the offense didn't really get in the flow until, you know, second quarter. But did it feel like from the start you guys weren't ready to play this game? Or Honestly, I just – I blame it all on myself. You know, I should I should have stepped up. I should have caught the two touchdowns I had, and I got to take the blame for it. Did you guys overlook this team? No, sir. Never. Did. Definitely not. I just think that um, there are missed opportunities. A lot of missed opportunities. A lot of um, a lot of we were shooting ourselves in our foot. That's what we were doing. Uh, we weren't supposed to lose this game. We we shot ourselves in our foot. KD, despite the drop, you had a really good afternoon. What allowed you to get back on track today? Best game turned to the worst game. For both of you, how, how much damage has three straight losses done to your 5-0 and start? I mean, honestly, it's not a damage. You know, it's, it's part of college football. You got to come back tomorrow and just watch the film, correct it, live with it, and grow up from the next game. Yeah, when there's adversity that strikes, you got to be, you know, mentally, um, mentally sharp, and you know, you can't be weak-minded. You got to, you know, just go to work the next day and keep moving. Um, you can't really do nothing about it, so it's out of your control. Uh, Trayvon, is is this loss a little bit, or maybe a lot a bit harder to kind of treat as something you put in the rearview mirror and you just go on to, to practice next week and? No, um, I think. Um, our team has the right mindset. We uh, if we lose, we we got to move on. We know that, so we can't keep um, you know holding on to this and feel bad, feel sorry for ourselves. We got to keep keep it moving and you know just get get ready for Arizona because you know they're gonna give us their best game as well. We got to be ready.